As per an ancient folklore, long long ago, the northern lights could sing, but had no colors. And there lived a bird, with the most beautiful colors, but no song. The lights gave their voice to the bird, in exchange for its magnificent colors. The beautiful auroras have always captivated our imagination. But, do these mesmerizing lights really have a sound? The answer to this question, is not a straightforward yes or no, and the scientific view on this is divided. Let's dig deeper to find out. From various corners of the world, countless witnesses have attested to hearing, accompanying sounds when the lights dance above. A gentle rustle, a subtle pop, or even a light clap, have been reported, spanning from Canada, to the Shetland Islands, and Norway. An observer in the 1930s, likened the sound to two planks, meeting flatways. Many scientists argue, that the auroras are way too far and are formed in the area of the atmosphere, which is near vacuum, making it almost impossible for any sound to travel to Earth's surface. Some even regard hearing these sounds as psychological and illusionary. Is there any truth behind these persistent accounts from multiple people? Some scientists have proposed a theory that these sounds might be originating in the lower atmosphere. The motion of the aurora can induce changes in the electrification of the atmosphere. This can create crackling sounds close to the ground, like the sounds of sparks of static electricity. So the sound, while not truly originating from the auroras, can be a result of it. <laughs>